Hey there, everyone. This is Al Cow Bling Bong's Revenge. And all right, so my goal today is to do the entire game, well, basically worlds one through six, all in one shot, so that I can uh, return to the Moon Pyramid fully equipped and ready for war, armed with knowledge and hopefully a little bit more resources. Uh, like every session of this game, you know, have none of them were edited and they all, um... Hey, hey. And all of them ended up being, uh, like, around... Oh, that's solid? No, it's not. It's a one-up that froze me. Oh, and that's how you get here. Okay. Yeah, so, um, stuff. I'm saying things. Well, at least I'm trying very hard to say things. But anyway, yeah, so, like, I feel like getting every... Doing, like, doing from World 1 to World 6 should take maybe around an hour? At least that's what I'm kind of- oh boy. I'm kind of hoping for. So, uh, let's see how this goes. You're probably gonna have noticed- oh boy, uh, the- The video time, though, of this video is not, like, an hour or whatever. Yeah, uh, I'm going to be doing some editing, obviously. I am planning on only showing the salient parts. Basically, you know, if anything new happens or anything major happens, I'm gonna show it real quick. And, uh, yeah, this is gonna be a heavily sum summarized, uh, take of my run. Because, like, there's just no reason to show back everything to everyone. Like, there's just... There is no reason at all for me to do that. This is me and my mission. Like, all this is new and exciting. Well, I mean, it's not really exciting, but it's new. It looks new, and it is. Sleepy enemies here. They just don't do much. See, because, yeah, like, I know about these things now. Like, converting, uh, the fruit thing plants into different prize gives and stuff and whatnot and stuff. So, uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's what I'm doing. I shall hopefully enjoy myself. Now, now the thing though, like the the thing that you can just move you around. Seems rude, but I can do that. Is that I need to make sure that I don't try to rush things. Like I have to play this uh, honestly. Like I need to try to get my prizes and stuff. I can't be tempted into rushing. So that's the biggest challenge. I'm sure I'm gonna be okay. Hey, check it out, that's how you get up here. I remember wondering how you would get up here. Ugh. That's how. You just transform that thing into a yellow guy. Simple! Not a surprise, it's a bonus upstairs. Hey, we've seen that bonus before. Yeah, I remember wondering how to get up here, and you know, that's it. Like, that's the whole puzzle. You hit the thing, and then you're somewhere, and then this guy's here, and it's like, wow, unbelievable. Like, this... I mean, it's not very exciting, but it is all new. Yeah, I could see that meat there. Well, check it out. I'm invincible. And I'm like, whoa, watch out, you got a pickaxe or something. It's pretty wild. What's that? Just some flashy things. Uh, if you're into that, oh, there's a one up here that I am into that. But also, I am into just like keeping to up here. Yeah, that's how you get these prizes. Oh, dude, I'm just gonna die here, huh? No! I am great, 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 great. So I'm pretty sure that's new. Oh, one of these things. So I thought that would let you fly, but I guess it just lets you glide still. Oh, you hold jump to fly. Okay, look at that evil face. It's beautiful. I'm so used to just spamming attack in this game, but no, it's jump. It's a- it's a feather of some kind. Alright, 
Bonk, calm down. Whoa! There's stuff up there, though, that I want. Alright, no deaths on the boss. I did get hurt a few times, though. He says drat. And I didn't get on the good train, uh, my first time here. I got exactly enough to get on the good train, uh, on World 1, which hopefully should make a little bit of a difference. And now I know also to get the extra heart. Although I, I wonder if the extra life would be better. I don't know. Anyway, World 1. This one kind of takes a while. But hey, I did it without, you know, dying. That's pretty good. Oh, that's a lot of points. What? One up here. That was not a good fight. <laughs> that was not a good fight. <laughs> 46! Oh man, almost to um, to the last level. But just slightly not good enough. Look at that. Just the tease. The taunt. Ah oh, man. Well, okay, maybe... Can I, like, slide it on? No. Yeah! I did it! I spent so much time trying to get these last time. I still missed one of the smiles, but I got the one up. So did I ever go up there? Ugh. This is pretty obvious. I don't know if I ever been. Mm, I feel like I'm probably dead. I don't remember. Perfect. Yeah, 10 and 10. Check it out. I got all the things and then I got to right next to the goal. Hey, check it out. Oh, wow. Got enough points. I got nine lives. I hope I can like at least keep some of these. <laughs> no, I've definitely been here. I'm trying to lose a lot of health here, I gotta be careful. Just random heart in there? Okay, I don't know if I made a... There's just hearts on this ice. Is that how you're supposed to heal in the aquatic tunnel? Sometimes there's just heart inside ice. But not always. Ballerina Chan. Oh, here the platforms are differently arranged, though. Which kind of changes the fight a lot. Wow, I'm just sucking it immediately, though. See, that was me just trying to approach her, and I got hurt, because her hitbox is just gigantic for some reason. Okay, and you cannot- if I- I tried to just bong there without jumping, and I took damage. Like... How do you explain this? But yeah, here you actually can use the height to actually get up to her in a way that you cannot do in the refight. So the refight fight is harder than this original fight. Wow. 
Really? Exactly 40. Okay, well, bonehead. They didn't die though. But like I said, like the fight is harder than it is in refight zone. And I check, I got exactly 40. Which is a number exactly between 30 and 50. 40 is a nothing number. Well, at least I get these upgrades. Oh, and if you get hurt, it stops. Mm. Perfect! Yeah! Okay. This feels really good. Once you get it, like once you understand it, and then you get the satisfaction of the score taking forever to fill up, then says perfect. And I think you get a 1-up. Which is, you know what? It's a good incentive, it turns out. In a game where lives actually do super matter. Where am I? Here I am. Oh, wow. Look at that. So, you know, hit it several times and you can get, like, even better prizes. Which, yeah, that's how this game works. Okay, just last minute victory. I... I don't know if I understand this boss, honestly. Like, it just... I, I don't get it. Really, this is that's what it boils down to. Like, I feel like I'm not sure how to get to him to be able to do damage. So that means I'm not gonna get the extra heart, but that might not be so bad because this is the place where they give you um, the one up instead. Which at this point, because like at this point, like when am I ever gonna get all of my hearts filled up? Whenever I find a large heart, basically, which you know is not super often. I feel like at this point, I think a 1-up is better value. 30. I'm not gonna get the... Um, the extension again, which means I'm gonna get the 1-up again, which is honestly what I want, so... Because, yeah, the level just kind of ends here, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so I'll get the 1-up again on a train, which is perfect! Just exactly where I need it to be. Please help me stay healthy. So what I want you to do is I want you to get the heart out. But I get that first, and then get that, and see, get the refill. See, that's that's just being smart. All right, last level to play today. See, so you would need to use you. That's not gonna be high enough. Alright, so I know how this thing works now. You tap jump, like if you were playing a Mario game or something. That's how you go up. But you cannot go up further up than that. So I can do that to kind of extend things by quite a bit. And that's how you get to there, and you get some nice healing. So there you go, I have mastered the fly bean. Or so I claim. Nope. Mm -hmm. I want that one up. It's very important. I only have 16 left. I think I only lost one 1-up one during my entire playthrough yet. 
Like, I was expecting to, like, edit in, like, deaths from time to time, you know? But, uh, yeah, no, I think I only died th the once. Like, way early in the game, too. Wizard is here, though, now. Making everyone's lives slightly less good. Okay, so now it's Mecha Lizard. I got some amount of health, though, so hopefully I can survive. Get away with that one. Flawless victory against Mecha Lizard. Whoa! Okay, that's exciting. All right, and here's the cutscene. So I am slightly better off than I was last time I got here. So hopefully, you know, this somewhat of a larger advantage is gonna help me out in being able to claim victory in this uh, boss rush plus type level. I pressed the wrong button. I, there was there was a bit of a fear in me of pressing load instead by accident. That would have been funny. I would have been... I don't know what I would have been. I don't know how I would have reacted.